You haven't been in for five months. Did I understand you were in rehab? No. What, why has it been five months? It hasn't been that long. May, yeah. Oh, yeah, because the one time I, got, I was sick. Okay. I was sick and I had to cancel, that's why. Okay. All right. Well, you gave us some really good nails to work with today. Good. I have one question, though. Yes, ma'am. A month ago, oh, my gosh, I bumped that right foot. Okay. I bumped it on my wheelchair when I was coming out of the bathroom and the locker. Man, was that sore. And it was swollen, but then it got better. But it bruised and everything. Okay. The end, you know, by the, by the top. Over here? The tips? Or up yeah, here? Yeah, up here. Over on this side? Yeah. Do you want us to get an x-ray before you leave? How am I going to do x-ray? I can't do hard to stand up. Well, we can do it with you in the wheelchair, can you? Okay, maybe, yeah. Okay. Is it still hurting? Off and on, not bad. Okay. It was really bad. Okay, well, that, that's when you should come in. No, but I didn't. I know. Because that's when I didn't feel good. Okay. You feeling okay pretty good now? Oh, yeah. Okay. I get that congestion, you know, that COPD. Mm hmm. I get that. And then, you know, I have nine great grandkids. Really? Yeah, and you know, they want to see grandma, you know. Are they all here in town? Almost so. Okay. So they want to see grandma. Uh huh. But doctor, you know how that goes. The kids, you know, they're in school. What do they get? Colds and all that stuff. Uh -huh. And I was told no one's just come around even with a cold. Because I just can't get, I can get pneumonia. You know right. what I'm saying? With your COPD? Yeah, yeah, yeah I can get pneumonia easy. Mm -hmm. So sometimes they come around. I don't like it. My daughter and my, they just want to say hi. I don't care. They want to say hi or what. That's, what, that's why there's Skype. Guys, I can just stay away from me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why we have Skype. They can talk to you every day. Yeah. And then, you know, I made an appointment. I can just come in the morning, you know, because my daughter babysits in the afternoon. Okay. Well, then they said I cracked all the week ago, that I couldn't come in until November 1st. But then I said, if there's a cancellation, call me. So Thursday, she called me. Oh, she good. said, there's a cancellation on Monday, Kendra. Wonderful. Do you want it? I said, yes. Because <laughs> the weather's nice for three days. That's why I picked nice day, right? Too hard to get out of the winter. Well, there's no snow or anything on the ground yet. Oh, I know. It's nice. Yeah. So I picked a good day. <laughs> How have you been? Great. How's your daughter? She's doing wonderful. She's yeah. in her third year of university. Isn't that something already? Yeah. I remember when you adopted her. I do too. 20 years you ago. You've been back there? We went back to China when she was five and went to the orphanage where she came from. Oh, yeah. And, um, but not since then. Yeah. But I still have some people that I communicate with back there. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, it really is. So that if she were ever to want to go back or go study there, she would have people there to connect with. That's good. Yeah. It's hard enough to drop from there, right? Yeah, they changed the rules. So if yeah. you look around, there really aren't any young children coming from there right now. Yeah, I know that, yeah. And, uh, yeah, which is kind of sad, but if they're increasing in-country adoptions, I think that's great, but I don't hold out a lot of hope for that. Yeah. Uh, I think that's more propaganda than anything. Yeah. But, but anyway, so she's doing great. She, um, good. Yeah. Does she live at home? No, she has an apartment near the university. Good, that's good. Yeah, I think that's kind of important. Yeah, yeah. For kids to learn how to do that. Exactly, get on your own. Yeah. And how to fix things like the phone call I got this weekend that she lost her wallet. Oh, really? With credit cards and driver's license. Oh. So she'll have to adult up and get it all handled.
That's a horrible feeling, though. Oh, I know. Where did it happen? Do you know? Um, somewhere on campus. Oh, okay. Nobody's used the credit card, but... Well, that's good. Yeah, so maybe... Uh, who knows? Who knows where it is, but that's a very sinking feeling. Yeah, it is. She wanted to cancel everything, her debit cards. Yeah. Alright, so what we'll do is uh, we'll pop the camera over to the other side so you can just keep it running. Perfect. The pressure is so high. <laughs> <laughs> so do you mind if I, if I talk about who No, that's okay. fine. So I won't use her name, but this, um, okay, so. I'll wait, start. I need to find your foot. Wait, oh my gosh. Wait, I should see zoom your out. jacket. Yeah, zoom out. <laughs> that would help. Yeah, okay. Zoom back in. Ha ha, there you are. Okay. <laughs> so our uh, videographer today um, traveled from out of state to come spend the day with me. Oh, where is she from? Um, I'm from Topeka, but I just moved oh, to really? Kansas City, Missouri. Yes. Huh. And she's thinking of changing careers and wanted to shadow me for a day. And she saw the Dr. Nail Nipper videos. And really? Me. Yeah. So she, it's been a pleasure and wonderful. Yeah. It's really, it's a lot of fun. I love teaching. I have residents and students come through all the time. I've been going to Dr. Spurley several years. And my husband was the first one that yeah. went to. Yeah, right. and you used to see me at the old office, yeah, which I haven't been in since 1995. Oh. So, so I've been I've been going over 20 years. Yep, over 20 years there. See, she's an awesome lady. Oh, <laughs> thanks, you guys. She's wonderful. All right, enough, enough. Checks in the mail. <laughs> well, she's good. But um. Yeah, so it, it's uh, it's actually quite. I, I love having students in. And well, that's wonderful. Yeah. And so, what did you do over the summer? Not much. No, they do. Okay. Binge any good TV shows or read any good books? Oh yeah, I, re I read a lot of religious stuff. Okay. So we're going to get you back on the schedule at about two and a half months for the next one. Yeah, if the weather's over. Right, if you slow. have to cancel and change, then yeah. you cancel and reschedule. Okay. See that? Like that whole piece is just coming, whole piece of nails just peeling right off. I know that, yeah. Um, so I don't want them to get quite so thick and so long. I know. Squeaky clipper, just noticed. Sorry. No, I don't think it's you. I think it's that foot. Oh, oh, where you yeah, injured yeah, it. Okay. Yeah. I will stop resting my hand right on it then. Because sometimes it hurts for another. It was bruised, but that went away. That was dumb how the, the wheel got caught on it. Well, you're not the first, and you won't be the last. But, um, now... All right, so yeah, we'll just take the x-ray and if it's broken, we'll... You don't do nothing anyway. Do well, it depends. Um, yeah, I mean, immobilizing your foot in a more rigid shoe, where oh, we really? can give you um, a post-op surgical shoe, and that usually helps with the pain and it helps it heal faster. Does it? Yep, it can. If, um, if it's broken and the pieces are not where they need to be to heal sometimes that can mean surgery how long ago did you do it you said About a month ago month ago okay. and it's still that sore well off and on okay 
Okay. Comes and goes. All right. Well, we'll just get an X-ray just to make us all happy, and probably it'll be fine. Is my guess. skin. Now do you have anybody who helps you with bathing or dressing? Oh no, yeah. That? Okay. Mm -hmm. When My they daughter. Okay. So have her just take the towel um, after your bath and just kind of roughly wipe where the nails are. Okay. Um, because there's a lot of dead skin. Okay. Yeah, because she lotions it all the time, you know. Yeah, and she keeps, uh, hopefully keeps the lotion out from between the toes. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if she keeps it out between, so I never really know. Okay. I should walk. Yeah, we want it on the top and the bottom, but not really in between the toes. Okay, I'll have to tell her that, yeah. Okay. Um, I will do that. All right. Oh, yeah, she helps in the shower. Great. I showered this morning. Had I have a shower before I see my doctor. <laughs> Graduated. Um, I have a de I have a degree in music education. Oh yeah. Yeah. Well, this is a little bit different. It's, yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> oh, cool. That's nice. Do you plan on moving them to Minnesota? Uh, you know, I'm not really sure. Uh, my boyfriend and I, we're, um, he's an actor. Oh, so, is he? Mm -hmm, so he acts in the Kansas City area. Really? Um, and does real estate out there, yeah. Um, but uh, the plan is for him to um, he wants to go back to New York at, eventually at oh, some point. You know, okay. Yeah. So he wants to do stage. Yeah. Yeah. His uh his friends that are out here though that I'm staying with they they act and sing as well. So oh, there's there's, there's, there's of, all the places that do it. Yeah. There's a, a pretty decent theater scene in this town. Yeah. Which is pretty pretty great. So you're just for the day. Yeah, I drove. Well, gee, I was drove lucky. in I was yesterday. Lucky, okay. <laughs> Why? I'm lucky. She's been a lot of fun. Yeah. And then my feet get wrapped, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, the stuff. swelling, as swollen as they are, they look better than the last time I saw you. Yeah. Well, she does a good job, I tell you that. Your daughter's doing it? Oh, of course. Okay. I haven't done it for quite a while, yeah. And then the only time I have home care is when I leave the hospital or nursing home, and I don't want that. Well, she does a good job. Yeah. 
she takes good care of you. Yeah. All right. I'm just going to put a little band-aid on there before we're done and okay. just leave that on till tomorrow and that'll be fine. Okay. It's not really bleeding, it's just, uh, yeah. Okay, so let me just get the band-aid on and then um, my sister will come in and she'll help you on with the, uh, with your socks and shoes and then we'll get the x-ray. Okay, okay. you x-ray with the shoe on then? Yep, it goes right through. Really? Oh, these shoes? No, we'll probably take it off. Yeah. Um, sorry, I thought you had a different kind of shoe on, but. I got to call the guy too and he come out to the house and I get a new pair. Oh, that he does the diabetic shoes and inserts? Oh, yeah. Good. You know the one you recommended? That comes out to your house? Yeah. Winkler. Oh, okay. Winkley. Winkley. Yeah. Okay, we're good. Thank you, thank you. Nice meeting you. Good luck to you.